Hey guys, so um, I just had a ganglion cyst removed from my wrist on Tuesday and it's now Friday. Um, I'm just going to do a little bit of um, testimonial on what it was like for me uh, so that you know what you're walking into if you're getting the same thing done. So the first couple of days, um, pretty painful, I'm not going to lie. Um, I relied pretty heavily on the uh, pain medications that they gave me. Um, starting on the third day, I was able to reduce the pain meds quite a bit, um, use ibuprofen more, Tylenol, things of that nature. Um, be warned, I, you know, assumed that this would be very, very simple. Oh, it's just a wrist, it's just a wrist. And, um, you know, I've been in bed or on the couch basically for the past four days in a row. Um, it just... No matter where you're getting surgery done or what you're having done, it takes a toll on your body. Um, there's a lot of swelling involved. It's using a lot of its energy to heal. Um, I didn't have an appetite for a while. The pain meds were messing with my sleep cycles. Um, so even though it's a minor surgery, um, you can expect quite a bit of disruption to your life. Uh, I'm gonna show you what my hand looks like right now. Um, so what they did is they went in, they removed the cyst while I was under anesthesia. Um, they offered to do it while I was awake and I said, no, thank you. And um, when I woke up, my hand was wrapped and it's been wrapped ever since. And I'm not going to see it until um, my two week follow up. And the first day it looked normal. The second day it was a little bit swollen and they were telling me to keep it elevated, ice it, take ibuprofen regularly. I was following all of their instructions to the T. I basically had ice on it 24 seven to try to prevent the swelling. And this is what it looks like now. All right, so there it is in all its beauty and splendor. Um, I basically feel like a beast. I can't use it very much. Um, the pain is mostly gone, but the swelling is just so incredibly uncomfortable. Um, that is obviously not what my hand normally looks like. And um, they told me that I can adjust the wrap, make it a little tighter or looser, however I need it. I try not to do it too much just because, you know, I want to leave it be and I don't want to mess anything up. So I've made it looser once and I've made it tighter once just to try to um, push some of the fluid out. And this is what a normal hand looks like for me. So as you can see, the other hand is quite a bit swollen. Typically I keep it wrapped like this to um, try to control a little bit of the swelling. So last night I slept for like 15 hours. I don't know why, um, I was pretty tired and I woke up just now and I feel like a lazy bum. Um, I've gained a bunch of weight even though I haven't been eating a lot. It's probably water weight. Um, so I'm gonna go to the gym. I'm gonna take it easy. I'm not gonna do anything with my hands. I'm probably just gonna walk around the track. Um, maybe do some squats, stuff like that. But I think it's time to get a little bit more active. And I think if I get my blood flowing a little better, hopefully this puppy will go down a little bit. So um, stay tuned. I'll update everybody once I get the uh, wraps removed or if anything major happens before then, I will also let you know. So here I am about five weeks out. Um, you can see that the wound has closed pretty well, um, no infection, and I'm assuming that this will fade and be almost not noticeable uh, eventually. However, you can see here that there is a bump and that is scar tissue. And the scar tissue prevents me from doing much with this hand. I have pretty good mobility at this point, but definitely not 100%. Um, I still can't use this hand to push up to get me off the ground. You can see how much scar tissue there is. It, it moves my skin around so you can see it. Um, and then I have trouble if I have to like unzip anything behind my back or anything that I have to grab and move my hand downward. That's painful as well. So I'm going to start a little bit of physical therapy and I will let you all know how it goes. <laughs> 